let us try to understand python as a programming language when i started teaching python language and in one of the batches before i started the session i asked a question to some student and i was really surprised to hear the answer i don't remember the exact answer but the meaning is something like this python is like a programming language that is based on a snake and that is the reason we have a snake as a symbol to represent python language and also some students said that python language most people don't understand it is a weird language it is strange it is not easy to understand by others etc is python really like that what most people think then my answer is no python is not like this what most people think about it you of course will begin to understand it really in a short span of time once we get into python programming guido van rossum i guess i spell the name correct over 20 years ago invented this python language what started out as a hobby project has now become a widely used general purpose programming language this language has been grown over a period and now it has become so much important in many areas including data science machine learning web development and even python can be used for desktop application development also and while i'm going through all this like snake stuff it turns out that it is not at all why python language was named python was not named for a snake even though we use the snake image all the time guido named python language based on the famous comedy serial monty python's flying circus most of the programming languages introduced in the 80s was very very serious and very complex and you had to really serious to figure out them to understand and guido thought i could probably write a programming language that wouldn't be that hard and it's the point to remember that the main aim of the python language is not to be hard don't forget that the language would be fun actually people should enjoy using the language and also he wanted to make sure that the language is not bad and it is not weak guido wanted to make this python language both powerful and also enjoyable so guido named the language python because the language should be as powerful like a python and also the developer should enjoy this language as much he was enjoying the comedy serial monty python's flying circus that is the reason why python turns out to be such a perfect language to use as your first programming language some of the important points you need to remember about python is that python is extremely versatile and can be found in thousands of different application worldwide python enables us to write clear and logical applications for small and large tasks additionally python can be run on different kinds of computers with few or observably no modifications it is very easy to build your own libraries in python and share it with the community as well over the years this has helped development of thousands of packages solving very specific problems for specific industries domains and things like that as i have said earlier today you can use python to build any kind of software from web programming to scientific programming from scientific programming to simulation from simulation to hardware programming from hardware programming 
even to video gaming. It's moved beyond being traditional programming language. It has become a technology platform with a thriving ecosystem of its own. Some of the biggest technical companies in the world use Python for their products. For example, many components of Google score technology like web scroller and the search engine is written in Python. YouTube has a significant amount of its implementation done in Python. The Dropbox desktop client is written entirely in Python. In addition to their desktop client, the Dropbox server-side code is pretty much written in the language, as well as making this the majority language used in the company. Additionally, Python is an open source, implying that you are free to download it, modify it, design applications using it in all forms. If you observe the various popularity index of the top languages to be learned in the year 2018 and 2019, we can observe Python language is one among the top three languages in all the surveys. So remember that Python is wonderful, easy to learn, powerful and very useful. So welcome to Python programming and I wanted to see you becoming a Pythonista. All Python programmers we call ourselves as Pythonista. So up next we are going to actually talk about the Python programming language.